Hi, I'm makeup artist Meredith Barraf and I'm here today to show you how to get Erin's look from the new Dream Angels campaign. We've already prepped her skin just with a little bit of tinted moisturizer and some concealer from Victoria's Secret. We're going to use the Glitterati bronzer. You notice I'm putting a little bit on my hand after I tap it on the brush just to make sure you don't have too much product. This is going to give the skin some glow and dimension at the same time. A little bit across the nose never hurts. <laughs> and then we're going to move into the blush. Starlet is a duo blush and it's got two tones and depending on your skin tone you can use one as a blush and one as an illuminator or you can mix the two together to get a very soft pink. And then smiling is really the easiest way to get it at the perfect spot on your cheek. And the final step to the cheek is the illuminator. And this is the VS That's Pro Radiant Effects. It's awesome. You don't want to waste the product, so just try to get one pump. It gives you a good amount of product. You can use your fingers, you can use a sponge, you can use a brush. I like using a brush. The way you can kind of buff it into the skin. I'm going to take a little bit to the top of the cheek to highlight where the top of the apple is. Feel free to take your middle finger or your fourth finger. You want to use those fingers because they put less pressure on the face. And actually a little bit on the lid. Now that we've completed her gorgeous glowing skin, we're going to move into her eyes. I'm going to start with this black pencil. now to the top of the eye with that crease color. The last step to the eyeshadow is to take that highlight color and look up. Just get it right in the corner. Again, this helps keep the eye open. So now we're going to go ahead and curl the lashes. Get as close to the lash line as you can without pinching yourself. This is the VS Triple Drama Mascara. The one thing I want to tell you about this mascara, and it's just mascara in general, is you don't want to do this thing that somehow we learned, which was to pump the mascara. You don't want to do that. It dries the mascara out. So you just look down. And by holding the eye, she can go ahead and blink, and it's not going to affect my application. You use the brush. Use the different parts of it. But tip is very good for grabbing the lashes, making sure you catch each one, and then using it horizontally, you really are able to get at all the base of the lash and separate them out. To create a more dramatic look, we're going to go in and we're going to create some lash on the bottom. 
And this is a great way to just, you just want to find the lashes first. So you use the tip. And then you come horizontally to feather it out. We're going to finish the look with Halo lip gloss. And you want to make sure that you don't move this on. The, the applicator is actually made so that it's, you have to layer it little by little. Otherwise, you're going to end up with too much. It's a perfect pout. So the look is complete. Erin, do you feel like a dream angel? I do. Thank you, Meredith. You're welcome. I hope the tutorial will help you achieve this look at home. Thanks for watching.